Plan for the world's largest floating wind farm gets the green light. Scotland's notoriously strong winds could pan out to be a blessing in disguise after the Scottish government recently approved plans for a floating wind farm. Existing offshore wind turbines, which need to stand on concrete or steel foundations, are expensive if anchored to depths greater than 40 meters. Instead of anchoring turbines to the sea floor, Statoil, a Norwegian energy company, plans to build a floating wind farm 15 miles off the coast of Peterhead, Scotland. Five floating wind turbines will be installed offshore. The base of each will consist of a floating steel tube filled with ballast. Each wind turbine, measuring about 258 meters high, is then tethered to the sea floor 90 meters down by three moorings. Because they're not actually attached to the seabed, these types of wind turbines are cheaper than traditional ocean turbines and can be placed in deeper waters. Each of the five wind turbines will have a 6 megawatt capacity. Together, the five will be able to power an estimated 20,000 homes. In 2014, Scotland generated 11,740 gigawatt hours of power from wind, which nearly made up a third of Scotland's total energy consumption. Statoil's goal with this $232 million pilot project is to demonstrate global market potential for turbines.